can see the relay is working perfectly. It has also reverse compatibility. I mean, it will update the status if I press the manual override button and it shows this live status in the application. Hello guys, I made a Sonoff Wi-Fi replica with ESP8266 and it has manual override button. If there is no Wi-Fi, you can still switch on or off and it has a 5 volt power supply here and ESP8266 I got from AliExpress and let me demonstrate how it works so my home Wi-Fi is off and I'm gonna power it on you can see it's it turned on and now there's no Wi-Fi but I can still switch the relay uh, it's gonna take a few seconds to work you can see the manual override is working okay now to use from mobile we need to enter our home Wi-Fi credentials into this ESP8266 I made a web server inside so we can anytime change the credentials of the Wi-Fi. Now, first you need to grab your phone and go to the Wi-Fi settings and connect with ESP access point and then go to the browser and here you're gonna type 192 168.4.1 and you will see some thing like this enter your Wi-Fi credentials as a ID and password and click submit it's gonna say success fully and now we're gonna reboot the ESP in order to connect to the home Wi-Fi network my router is off right now i'm going to turn it on and then reboot my esp and get back to you okay my wi-fi is turning on i'm going to connect to the home wi-fi network here tesla and i'm going to reboot the esp8266 by pressing the reset button here Now it will connect automatically to the home Wi-Fi network and I'm going to open link application and now it will show that our ESP has been connected to the Wi-Fi network. Okay, it says Wi-Fi connected and now we're gonna switch from here and you can see the relay is working perfectly it has also reverse compatibility i mean it will update the status if i press the manual override button and it shows this live status in the application and if the power goes out and comes back it will remember its last state so I'm going to turn off the ESP and let's see what happens when the power comes back. Now you will see that it will turn back on automatically. Wonderful, isn't it? And it also works with the Google uh, Assistant. Uh, I'm going to use Google Assistant for switching. Let's see how it works. Um, Turn on the light. And there was light. 
Turn off the light. Pursuit. You can see it's working with the system and everything. So if you want me to make a video on how I made this, please mention in the comments below and I will make a video on how to make this one with the code and sketch and everything you need to know about this. And it has, uh, is very um, easy to make. So please let me know if you want the video on how to make this one with the sketch and everything you need to know. Thank you for watching.